Time to go, right? Always start on time, end on time. Phone gonna work. We got a buzzing. All right, how about that? Can you hear me now? All right. We're gonna try to use a little different microphone up here. It's gonna be a, a good evening. It's always a good evening to come and worship the Lord, but we're gonna have some treat for the young people. This is our singing night. We're gonna have the young men sing here for a message from Kaiser Phillips, and uh, so we're looking forward to that. Uh, one announcement I need to make, uh, I talked about the mission work. I talked with him and him a little bit in that work out there, and out what your interest might be. Summer. So if it's something you might be interested in, why, you can kind of start. Judy's raising her hand. It's a little early about, and uh, so good things are happening, and being a part of that, we're right. It's all the announcements I have. Anything else we need to announce? All right. Okay. We're hopefully if I can do it. So My name is Ty and I'll be singing I'll Fly Away. got in his hand. He's ready to go. What a friend we have in Jesus. Constantly. My name is Austin. I'll be singing Seeky Faust. My name is Kaiser Phillips, and I want to talk about being brave. In the book of Daniel, be brave and do what's right. Number one, Daniel and his friends lived in Israel. They were kidnapped from their homes. 
They had to learn to speak a, diff a new language. Who is them, no matter what changes they had to make. And because of their faith, God did help Daniel in their new home. Number two, King Nebuchadnezzar made a golden idol and told all the people they must bow down and worship the idol or be thrown into a furnace of fire. Daniel's Daniel friends knew they were were supposed to only worship God, so they refused to bow down to the king's golden idol. Since they didn't obey the king's rules, they by choosing to follow God, none of them were burnt or even hurt from because of their bravery. Number three and he made a new rule that no one could pray to any god except the king. If you don't obey this new law, the king would have you thrown into a lion's den. Did Daniel chose to do to be faithful and he continued to pray to God every day. King Darius heard that Daniel had disobeyed his new law, so he had Daniel thrown into the den of lions. God protected Daniel. He closed the lion's mouth, and Daniel wasn't hurt by any of the lions. We can learn, we can learn how to be brave by reading these three stories about Daniel and his friends in the Bible. We should never... Let other people try to influence us, uh, us to be to do things that are wrong. We have to be brave and be an example to our friends and family to show them that is always best to do what God wants us to do. We should never be scared to do what's right because God. We know God will always protect his children. Many of us at eight years old could have gotten up here and done that. I, I would have fainted <laughs> a good job. All right, he's an excellent. Skies and rainbows. And uh, I, I just certainly work on their lessons, them how much you appreciate and all the good things that they are doing. The young, older men are going to sing. So. Glorious Father in heaven, Father, I say that you're presented as his father. We see the power of his father and realize that you are the one true in a way that will praise you in a way that will be in accordance to your word and showing all glory to you. Father, we ask you a special blessing that we ask that you put a special hand upon them and heal them, Father, and bring them back that they can be again with their family. We, that we fall short from time on those 
uh, situations. Thank you for your son, for the life that he lived, the death that he died, and the resurrection that he had for us, giving us strength and giving us guidance. Bless us throughout the remainder of this service. Bless us um, as we partake tonight in this trunk or treat. Bless the young people that all is Phil Mirror sing all that often, so it, it's really, really good song when everybody. near the cross? Catching on, we'll just say it that way. Fly away and sing all three verses. <laughs> songs are this one has a text 81 through 33 therefore do not be ancient gentiles seek after these things
in the last verse. Master. Master.
and a sign of parting. The text I'll be using today is, learn to turn there in your Bibles, uh, and I just want to say thank you for letting me be able to do this. 11 through 17. Now, between Samaria, or Samaria and Galilee, the leprosy met him. They stood at a distance, show yourselves to the priests. And as they went, they were cleansed. He his feet and thanked him. And he was God except this foreigner. And he said the story of Jesus and the ten lepers and how he was. Uh, I noticed how ten of these lepers just didn't you have leprosy it's kind of to see if you're if you have cancer or some kind of cra- uh, some kind of terrible it would kind of give you the stamp of approval and you don't have leprosy anymore and if you walked up there and you look and if you've got sores all over your body you probably still have leprosy so uh uh hmm lost my train of thought <laughs> So it was, you would look like a fool if you were, if you went up and you still had leprosy. And uh, Jesus just said, go and show yourselves to the priest. They could have said, you haven't healed us yet. I, I mean, I'm taking this here and right now. I don't want to, how it would unfold. And that's how we need to, and to, you know, ends up. But that's uh, point number one, <laughs> the two different what God is when people are in low point in their life, living outside of their village. And uh, to God or uh, being than themselves, your family or a friend, uh, it's when something bad you figure, and uh, when uh, 15, one of them, and he, one of them, when he saw he was healed, came back praising God. Each of these, no, wait. He was at a high point of his life. When he, I'm sure that he had some, but instead he came back at the high points of his life. And we need to do that. It doesn't at times. And as we praise God when we win, you, it's just a constant. The last point is the fact that we're kind of, and Jews and Gentiles just didn't like each other, and therefore nobody liked the Samaritan. When he mentions that, um, sir, that everybody, can us, just like how he was at, want to be added into the Lord's church, or if you need the prayers of the church, you may do so as we stand. Sing number 72.
receive our thankful beautiful day that it's the first worship has been accepted that we get that are doing so well in leading songs and teaching lessons and Heavenly Father bless them the powers of its military or anything that our light might shine as a world Holy Father we're so thankful for the fellowships that's 